So after the performance is done and everyone gets to play, mm -hmm. do the guests get to play with the performers or the guests play with each other or like... So mostly the guests play with each other. The problem okay. is, is that um, for us, at least performers and things like that, they're all using condoms and things. Right. You can, I guess, if you wanted to. For me, I really just abstain and just uh, I'll play with other performers um, if there were people there that were brought in from the industry, it might be like, okay, like, you know, we've been doing this certain role all night. We're ready to go. Like, let's go put on a show in this bedroom. For us, it's just enjoying and having fun together. But to the guests, they're like, oh, like, this is kind of being like, oh, wow, like, we're, let's like watch or let's like jump in, you know, type of thing with it. But yeah, everyone there is is very pleasant as far as consent is always mandatory. Everyone is always kind of in the moment of even asking, like, oh, can I touch you? Can I do this? Can you do this? Is it okay if, you know... What do you like? What are your, yeah, as a couple, like, what do you, you okay with, you know? And so it really just creates this really positive environment. Yeah, a lot of the guests, they're really just playing with each other. The performers, a lot of times, will be asked or invited to, you know, I'm like, I've spanked some people before, different things like that, but nothing where it's like fluid yeah. exchange because I'm going to be going to work two days from then. And yeah, I'm like, yeah, it's yeah. just not worth it to me to do that type of thing. So yeah. I've kind of wanted to one time and just been like, cancel work for a week and just like do it, you know, just yeah. to do it the real way and have some fun. But yeah. 